Hey everybody, happy Sunday. It's raining and I wanted to show you guys one of my favorite recipes to make when it rains and it also allows for some leftovers for the week. So it's a good recipe, especially if you're still struggling to get some meal prepping done. Um, I'm gonna show you guys my setup for my turkey chili. So I have all my ingredients out here. Um, these are my spices. I love the Himalayan salt. So this is that pink Himalayan salt, some good minerals in there. Uh, I've got black pepper, oregano, turmeric, uh, extra virgin olive oil. Um, so kind of cook with that. And then um, these are my favorite kind of beans. I have kidney beans and black beans and they're a great source of protein, plant-based protein. Um, and they're just very versatile. You can add any type of beans that you like. These are the just two that I picked for this one. And then for my sauce, I have diced tomatoes and I also have a big can of just regular sauce over here so crushed tomatoes um, if you're making this for a larger family you might want to double the amounts um, that you see here just so you can make a bigger batch um, then I go over to my vegetables I have some asparagus I just saw it in the store and I was really excited because I haven't had asparagus in forever and then I have some a stir fry blend, this is a frozen vegetables. Um, this one has broccoli, pepper strips, uh, mushrooms, and carrots, I believe. Um, so just a good variety, and it's easy from just taking it out of a frozen bag. Um, and then I have some chopped kale. So you can get really creative with what types of vegetables you like. I mean, you could do really anything goes in a chili. So pick your favorites. Um, I've done sweet potato in the past. I've done cauliflower. Um, and so definitely very versatile. I put spinach in it. Um, so you just kind of pick your favorites and see what you like. And then over here, this is what I'm actually gonna start with. I've got some ground turkey. I know I have the beans as my source of protein, but I also really was excited about getting ground turkey. So I decided to do a mix of both the beans and the ground turkey. You can do whatever you want. Um, there's so many ways you could put ground uh, lean beef in here. You can do just beans, you can just do meat. Totally your call. Today I decided to go with some ground turkey. And then I also have my onion and my garlic over here. So what I'm gonna do first in my pot is I'll put some olive oil, all the spices at the bottom, and then I'm gonna start to cook down the onion and the garlic. And once that starts to get a little soft and starts to get flavorful, um, you can smell it. I'm gonna add the ground turkey. After I add the ground turkey, I'm gonna just make sure that I'm mixing and just checking and making sure that the meat's starting to get cooked. So once it starts to turn white and some browning on there, that's when I'm gonna start to add in my sauce. Okay, so put the sauce in, mix it around, and then I'll start adding in my beans. And again, just mixing it around. And then you could let that sit for a little while, but uh, I'm not super patient. So I'll just stuff in all my vegetables uh, at the same time and then put a cover on it, um, let it sit, usually at like medium to low heat for about an hour or so, um, depending on how big your batch is. It might take more or less time. And again, depending on what ingredients you use. So. I'm super excited about making this today, and if you guys are um, making it at all this week, please uh, feel free to comment, or if you've made um, a different type of chili in the past, I'd love to hear what your variations are. I hope you guys have an awesome day, and I will post a picture when I'm done with my chili.